Hey there. I, today, I just wanted to share a poem that I had written um, exactly two years and two days ago today. Um, it was a time where I was struggling a lot with self-worth, self-harm, self-judgment, and I've come a long way from two years ago. It was the year, I don't know how I'm still alive, I'll put it that way, but regardless of all that I've been through and all that, how I've strengthened, um, today was a hard day. It's, it's been a hard 2022, but today was a very hard day, and by breathing and by others supporting me, uh, I got through it. And I think about people whose care and inquiry and sometimes just sitting here and listening in person or from afar are just positive intentions, positive and honest feedback has helped me and anyways I just wanted to share and read a poem because other people's poems really really um, helped me like I love the poet um, Andrea Gibson and Jaya John and Morgan Harper Nichols those are all just off the top of my head some people's these words touch me but there's so many so that's just a snippet um, Anyways, this is called Perennial. You are worth it. You are worth it. You are worth it. Will you breathe this in with me? Exhale out all that never was, but came to be. There has been an illness brewing within me, and it manifests from time to time as self-hatred. When I looked at my life, I saw failure around every corner. DK rising, yelling, stop, slow, speed in the gate, go. You just move at the pace you were made for. For as storms ephemeral, love perennial. And even when gusts blow you down to your molten core, please know that you are so much more than the ebbs and flows of these highs and lows. I don't know what you face, but without a doubt, you were made for this. Uncling, dare to let your shrink wrap fall. You are tall as the oak, old as the cedar, Loving as a sturdy stump which held your weary body upright, so attached at the tendons, though ruffled in spirit. Do you remember the night you cried unspoken questions to the stars? When this dark night of the soul appears, please place ear to heart home, cheekbone to earth bone. Fall asleep as you are able. You will not miss the 24-7 feeds, laser lenses that glint so lovely, graphically. I marvel at how much you have seen behind heavy corneas and a reshattered heart. I admire what you have hidden so desperately, and I cry with delight in what you yearn for, that quiet heart, sole survivor of so many delayed starts, and you wrinkly-eyed, silver-stranded, not forsaken warrior, so full of space, so full of grace. You always were, you will always be. It was always you. So that was a poem I wrote to myself. And I want to share this, um, if it may be 
So there's some sort of light for anyone if it resonates. I just really felt compelled to share that today. And it's called Perennial. So thank you for listening. Um, sending out lots of love. All right. Peace.